I have a problem with the way we're, we are um, legislating defense out of the game. That's what we're doing in the NBA. The way we're teaching the officials, we're just enabling players to BS their way to the foul line. Um, if I were a fan, I wouldn't have want, wanted to watch the second half of that game. It was disgusting. It was just, you know, just baiting, baiting refs into the calls, but the refs have to make those calls because that's how they're taught. So I have a real problem with the way we are. Um, we've legislated defense out of the game in this league, and uh, the players are really smart in this league. And for, for over the last decade or so, uh, they've gotten smarter and smarter, and they're just um, they're just enabled. We have enabled the players, and they are taking full advantage. And it's a parade to the free throw line, and it's disgusting to watch. Welcome, everybody. You just saw Steve Kerr make some comments that were very interesting, uh, especially to me. Let me just talk about real quick and give you a little bit of uh, my opinion on what Steve Kerr just said. So me personally, and a lot of especially older NBA fans, I've been saying for years that um, the NBA has moved away from actual defense that there's no defense no good defense being played in the league anymore and the comments that you just heard from steve kerr confirm that everybody was especially younger fans sorry guys but you have not watched the older nba maybe reruns or something like that it was just completely different um steve kerr said it himself here so the last decade that defense has been literally pushed out of the league. Defense is literally not allowed anymore. Real defense is really not allowed anymore in the NBA. And that's why you have players uh, of lower statute and of statute of LeBron James um, doing and accomplishing things that have never been done before because they have never had it as easy as they do now, which is confirmed by an NBA coach in the comments you just saw. So that's one thing. Um, players are playing more years now. They're scoring more points than ever. 50% um, of the shots in the game are three-point shots, which is makes the game actually pretty boring, if you ask me. To me, today's NBA, in a lot of games, not every game, but a lot of games, is like watching an NBA 2K uh, game. You know, players playing an NBA 2K game. On PlayStation or something like that on Xbox that's that's pretty much what it resembles like I said half the shots are like three pointers there is not much of an inside game anymore like there used to be with great centers so that that those are my comments on that um, there's almost no inside game very little physicality on defense allowed making players that shouldn't look like superstars look like superstars these days. And believe me, there's a lot of real superstars in the league. Some of these players look like superstars when they're not. The NFL, for example, is watched four times more than the NBA. Play less games, but it's it's watched four times more than the NBA. And what is the major reason for that? People like physicality and toughness and the nba is moving further and further away from that the nba has so much flopping right now literally that they actually instituted an anti-flopping rule this season just think about that when you have a league that is instituting an anti-flopping rule how soft has that league become that tells you pretty much everything you need to know. If coaches are starting to talk about it, that means there's a problem. Now, this is directly to Steve Kerr. Most likely you won't see this, but fans have been saying this for years. And a lot of coaches didn't want to admit this. Even Steve Kerr, I believe in the past, was speaking out against uh, it, that it's not true that the NBA has become too soft these days, but now, it's starting to impact his team and it's aggravating to him he brings it up 
I would like the NBA to go and find a nice happy medium between the 80s and 90s brawlers, you could say, and today's game. Because today's game is just, they moved too much in the direction of offense, and it's just not, it's, it's not as entertaining as it should be. Nobody wants to sh- watch, you know, players shoot threes most of the game. Come on, just threes and dunks. Threes and dunks. Threes and dunks. Like, come on. Nobody wants to see anybody injured. But this game has to get tougher. On defense, it has to be tougher. I understand they wanted to run the score up and have higher scoring games and all that stuff. But this is just getting ridiculous right now. And to be honest, grinding a game out sometimes is much more exciting than looking at 53s a game being taken. To me, it's ridiculous how the game has changed. I've watched the game since early 90s, late 80s. I'm glad an NBA coach actually called this crap out. See you in the next one. Remember to subscribe.